Hi, I'm State Senator Martha G. Scott of Highland Park, and I am here today uh, at 250 Moss, where this family is renovating this home, uh, and uh, it'll be back on the tax roll, and we need a number of houses on the tax roll. I serve as... Um, the legislative, one of the legislative chairpersons for the legislative bill. And we're doing homes all over in our districts this summer. And I am just proud to be here in Highland Park because where we are located today is a historical district. And so it means bringing these homes back uh, will be just, just great. I mean, you cannot find any place, these old homes like Highland Park. Uh, they are well structured, and so just a little tender love and care uh, from these individuals, uh, we will have another home back on the tax roll again. Today we're very proud to be selected as one of the participants for the 2008 legislative bill, which is a project that some of the legislators had made a commitment within their districts to work on properties to see what we as community development corporations do. And we are really excited and we're very proud and we're very thankful um, to be a part of this 2008 legislative bill. This uh, project is about revitalizing the area and putting these houses back on tax roll. Getting some young men to uh, uh, be uh, trained in, in the uh, construction field and to um, help them to get their lives back together. This is going to be a total renovation here. We're going to uh, be doing drywalling, uh, painting. We're going to uh, totally redo the kitchen, the bathroom, and um, just pretty much uh, a, a rehab project here. Everything is going to be new here. And I'm here uh, working with Mrs. Airy with Mines, and we d decided to team up because I have a building across the street, which will soon become a food pantry, where we can reach out to the you know the needy families, the, the, the families that's in distress, and you know just lo loan a helping hand, and uh, just to help enhance the community and bring the community back. There is problems in each area, Highland Park and Detroit, so we are trying to help be a solution to some of the problems.